Zora's closed process dashboard was designed to give your organization a summary view of data validation and real-time insights into your financials. Historically, many organizations would wait for month end to go about the process of validating data cleanliness and begin the process of closing out the current period. With the closed process dashboard, Zora's customers have the ability to pull these tasks out of month end close and have data validation happen in real time as orders are booked. As you can see here, if the month were to end today, I as the head of order to cash, as an example, would know that these are the three areas of the business that I need to focus on in order to complete my process and begin passing entries over to the GL. Here on the trends analysis tab, I can see which revenue contracts are driving the differences in the current period from where I had told FPNA that we would land at the end of last month. For example, here at the top, I can see the new contracts which booked this month, which are driving additional revenue, along with down here, the changes that had happened to orders that had booked in prior months. Again, each of them leading into the difference between last month's forecasted revenue into this month's current actual revenue. Historically, this type of insight would only be found after a fair amount of analysis performed across probably multiple teams, including RevOps, Revenue Accounting, FP&A, so on. Now, this information is readily available in real time, and decision makers no longer need to rely on staff to dig through CRM reports, manual tracking spreadsheets, whatever it might be, to determine what is driving differences in forecasted to actual revenue. Here on the trial balance tab, I can see exactly what the balance sheet would look like if the period were to close today, giving all of the revenue contracts information and, and, and reporting that's running through the platform. I know exactly where I land. I can already start bridging roll forward reports from prior period to current month. And I know what things look like period to date, quarter to date and year to date um, in real time. Again, tracking all of this information and all of the uh, revenue contracts that are, that are cycling through the platform.